Welcome back to the Mysterious Forest. I'm your host, Cinnamon. It's the Viridian Forest, where you search around the forest, not like anyone would really care, because it's just a forest, for God's sake. Yo, you can't jam out if you're a Pokemon trainer, G. So, this bug catcher thinks he's a cool guy, so we'll teach him otherwise, because bug catcher Doug would like to battle. He sent out Weedle, and I sent out Juju. Sick him, Juju! Weedle will now use a poison sting, which should result in a poison immediately. Yes, of course, because I am the luckiest person in the world. And you should all know that if you are with me, you are guaranteed to win gambling tournaments and all other things that require luck, like chow racing, I guess, or something. I don't know. So anyway, scratch him to death, Juju. Congratulations, Juju. You have been a good Juju. I hear the popo outside. I wonder what happened. I don't care. Come back, Juju! You've done enough chaos for one day! Burn him, fuego! Weedle! I don't care about your weed or your dole. I shall burn you without a second thought because you're a bug and bugs easily burn. Don't you know your common math? Of course you do. Kakuna! That means we will keep fuego! because Kakuna's are rather annoying. Ember to death, because you're an annoying Kakuna. And with that, you're dead. Fuego gained experience. Ain't that just nifty? Bugcatcher Doug is dead. He ran out of Pokemon, of course, because he's stupid. So let's go back. That totally stinks. I'm going to catch. Let's. I'm going to go while you try to catch some stronger ones. I'll go and heal my Juju. I'll be right back. And we're back! I have just healed Juju, and I bet he's caught more Bug-type Pokémon, but I don't care enough to battle him because he's kind of annoying. Hey, look! A ball! Let's get it! An antidote! Let's pick that up, because that could actually be useful. Oh yeah, I'm not supposed to use the speed-up thing. Okay, so I really hope I didn't just screw up the video there, but just to be safe, we shall reset the thing just so I don't get into the habit of pressing the speed-up button. So, with my luck, I got into a random encounter, and on the first Poison Sting, we got poisoned again. Ain't that just lovely? So, um, back to the Pokemon Center for us. And we're back! Okay, so, that was annoying. Um, back into the Viridian Forest, where bugs run wild, and it's spooky. And there's another bug catcher guy, let's just ignore him. And by ki- and- oh, I already messed that joke up. Oh, let's go cry in a corner. Okay, let's try that again. Except not really re pre record, but whatever. Let's stop complaining over spilt milk and continue. Instead of cut leaving him be, let's cut out the battle and kick his ass. And by doing that, we have leveled up Juju and as well as Fuego twice. So, wow, my English is god awful at this moment in time. So, let's continue on. And I just completely did a battle while something. Um, I guess that doesn't matter. Okay, you can't catch Pokemon that belongs to someone else. So, anyway, hi there, Mr. Guy. Let's battle one more time. Last guy until we leave the forest, I believe. And his name is... Bugcatcher Semi. What kind of name is that? That's like a girl name. But, hey, I'm a girl and my name is Cinnamon, so... I guess that's okay. String shot, you say? That's only gonna lower my speed. That's not gonna do you good. Now, the only thing that would actually do you good is if you poison me. When you haven't, I was kind of expecting you to, but that's okay. I, I'd rather not be poisoned. It's kind of annoying. He gives. We're pretty good at this. So, let's head on out as all these bug catchers just suffer into the forest for all eternity. And we're finally out of that forest. What, it only took us two episodes? Not even full episodes? Back in Route 2, there's nothing much new, so... Uh, let's see what's a stew. So, Pewter City! Let's go and heal ourselves, I guess. And after healing ourselves, I guess I'll do a bit of grinding because I guess it's almost time to go against the first boss of the game, aka Gym Leader. Um, so yeah. Hey, Jigglypuff, how you doing?
That was beautiful. So anyway, let's move on, and what was I gonna do again? Oh yeah, it is grind time for me! And we're back once more, and by grinding I only just really leveled up Juju once. Just to catch up with Fuego! And now he knows Karate Chop! Which is the most ferocious move in the universe, of course, because... It's true because Fuego knows it. Let's see what's in this house, just because. Hi, old guy. Hi, little kid. Yeah, 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 they're all effective. Who cares? Not me. Ha, ha, ha. Ha, I'm funny. So, let's go on and face the first enemy of the world. Just inside this brown-roofed hut. But it's not a hut. Because it's a gym. Gym, gym, gym. Let's see who we are up against. Leader! Rock! The Rock Solid Pokemon Trainer! Well, Brock, this will be your last day to breathe under a rock! Let us battle, Brock! Hey! Uh, oh, hi there. I don't want to fight you. I'm 10,000 light years from facing Brock. Isn't that a distance? Okay, I'll fight you. This is going to be very pointless considering how... Fighting type is good against rock type, so this gym is going to be particularly easy. Had I just kept Fuego, Fuego would have had his money betted against him or something, I don't know, or gambling or something. Because fire is weak to rock and rock is actually rather good against fire. But just for the sake of giving him an experience, let's send Fuego out to fight Santru. Because the Santru is gonna be a ground type, meaning it won't be that big a deal. So, Ember him to death! I really need to get a drink. Ember him to death again! So yeah, Santrus are also kind of interesting. I kind of like them as a Pokemon, and I would have considered keeping them if it wasn't for the fact that, uh... Well, the fact that I needed to get other types of Pokemon. So, no Pokemon for us. So, Fuego grew to level 12 in defeating that sand trail. And Liam is defeated. Turn, not yours in time, it measure distance. We got $220 for winning. Brock, now we must fight after I heal myself. Brock, you have now met your match. So you're here, I'm Brock, I'm Pewter City's gym leader. My rock hard willpower is evident even in my Pokemon. My Pokemon are all rock hard and have true grit determination. That's right, my Pokemon are all the rock type. Did I mention that my Pokemon are rock type? <laughs> you're going to challenge me knowing that you'll lose? That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine then, show me your jelly donuts. Because nothing beats a good jelly donut that looks like an onigiri. So, it's Brock. I will fight you, Brock. Take your badge. And... I don't know. Randomly defame you. Karate Chop! It's super effective. However, it's not enough to take down a Geodude of the Brock origin. It's super effective once more. Geodude has fallen. And Juju is now level 12. Not that that's going to make a big difference. So, Onyx! Just for... Mm, mm, tittles and chuckles and winks and fiddles. Let's get out Fuego to do something. Hi, Onyx! Goodbye, Fuego! That's not Pokeball because we're not trying to catch you. We're trying to get Juju back! Sick him, Juju! And of course he binds us, so now we can't switch even if we wanted to. He has a pretty de decent tactic, so low kick him to death. Because low kicking makes him fall hard. You know what they say, the bigger they are, the harder they fall. My throat is dying right now. It's super effective, Brock has fallen. Juju has won! the boulder badge! We had defeated Leader Brock. That was a tough battle. It took you for granted. In 
And so I lost. As proof of your victory, I can throw you this, the official Pokemon League Boulder Badge. Cinnamon received the Boulder Badge from Brock! Brock is nothing but a rock now! Just having the Boulder Badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. It also enables the use of the move Flash outside of battle. Of course, a Pokemon must know the move Flash to use it. Shut up, Brock. No one likes you. You are a terrible gym leader. I should know because I'm a gym leader of my own school! Fire type, of course. A technical machine contains a technique for Pokemon. My throat is really cracking and I should really stop making a video now. Shut up, Brock. So, that has been Pewter City Gym Badge Battles. I'm Cinnamon and I will see you guys next episode.